And this week we're looking back at the pop song She's a Mod, which was a worldwide hit in 1964 for New Zealand group Ray Columbus and the Invaders. Shall we take a look at some footage? Yes. <laughs> Studio guests, one of our four is Billy Christian, part of the Invaders' original lineup. All our teams need to do is choose who they think Billy is. We also have an electrician, a horticulturalist, and a graphic designer. Ooh. Team one. Yes. You get first pop at this. Okay, I would like to just to sort of get a picture in my head yeah, sure. of who's who here. Number four. Number four? Can you hear me, number four? <laughs> number a, four? Just a nod. Yep. <laughs> First and foremost, the lack of response time there suggests horticulturalist. <laughs> Which member of the band is it? Do we know that? What, did, what, what did he do? What in did the he band? play? Uh, uh, was it bass guitar? Bass guitar. Bass guitar. Bass guitar. Okay. On the, on the, okay, so on the no... count of three, can you uh, do your best mime of bass guitar playing, please? One, two, three. Oh, that's good. Excellent. <laughs> So you yet more evidence that the bass guitarist does all fuck all in the band. <laughs> <laughs> you know, I tell you what, in that season mod video, Ray Columbus is a singer, yeah, yeah. but there was a guy behind him playing what I think was the bass, and he had like bass? quite prominent cheekbones, and that <coughs> makes me suspect that it might be number one. So I think it's also number one, and I don't know if it was the cheekbones so much as he was trying not to laugh because of the way Ray danced. <laughs> the principle is that your feet don't move. Oh, okay, well one has moved fuck all, so it's him. Yeah. <laughs> Team two. We're looking for someone who had so much sex in the 1960s that they're probably still tired. <laughs> well, then it's, yeah. then it's right definitely cool. three. <laughs> <laughs> he has basically turned into Father Time. <laughs> All I know is that number two looks like a cool guidance counsellor. <laughs> he's, like, he's like, hey, take a seat, let's rap about some guff. Right, I, my initial instinct is it's definitely four. One looks like a racing commentator. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Two's the graphic designer that overcharges people. <laughs> All right, let's go four then. Four? OK, oh, well, okay. to the chagrin of my team, <laughs> Jeremy, I'm going to go for number four. All right, team one, you've gone number one. Team two, you've gone number four. Can I ask Billy Christian, member, bass player from Ray Columbus and the Invaders, to step forward, please? He's number one. Yeah! <laughs> Billy, thanks so much for coming on the show and a uh, round of applause. Iconic. Pleasure. <laughs> I'd like to say not to shake your head too much because this is what happens. <laughs> <laughs> uh, when, Ray, when Ray came to you with the lyrics and he said, hey guys, I've written this song, uh, basically uh, we're going to say she's a mod heaps. Uh, quite a bit, actually. And uh, then when we're done saying she's a mod, I just figured uh, we'd just say yeah. Quite a bit. What did you think? We just said yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and when you got to Australia and you got swamped by girls... We did, yes. Did, did you fight them off or did you schedule them in? Uh, no. <laughs> We used to run away from them because you know, the Aussie girls are worse than the Kiwi girls. So, yeah. You ran away from all the girls? <laughs> well, you've got no choice. If you don't, you get all your clothes ripped off. Yeah. And Do you know Darren Hughes? Hughes or... <laughs> <laughs> so, Billy Christian from Ray Columbus and the Invaders, thanks very much for coming on Seven Days. Good stuff, Thank you mate. for having me. <laughs> Can we ask uh, our graphic designer to step forward, please? Oh, yeah. oh OK. And our electrician. Really? Wow. Which means number three, you must be a horticulturalist. Yeah. <laughs>